In today's video, we will go over how to properly adjust headlight beams and replace the headlight housing. This video applies to all of our models. If you have the old style halogen headlights, the replacement process will be the same, although the beams are not adjustable. To adjust the headlight beams, there are two knobs located on the back of the headlight housing. Turning the knob left or right will raise the beam and move it side to side. You can access the knobs through the fender well. If you have a lifted cart, you will need to remove the flare as the screws protrude and could result in injury, as well as prevent the fender well from dropping. Next, use a flathead or something slim to pry down the fender well enough to get your fingers in. Then pull down to pop the plastic push rivets out. Once in, you can see the knobs located here. It's a good idea to have the cart positioned against a wall to see the beams as you make your adjustments. Once you're done, simply remove any remnants of plastic rivets, push the fender well back up into place, and install new plastic rivets. To replace the entire headlight housing on a vehicle, you will need to get inside the fender well on the side of the headlight you are replacing. If it's a lifted vehicle, first remove the flare. Again, grab something slim to pry down the fender well enough to pull it down and pop the plastic push rivets. You will need a stubby Phillips screwdriver and you will be removing these two screws seen here on this nose that has been removed from a vehicle. The next two screws you can access reaching in through the dash. Gently pull up on the dash to access this area. These two screws are seen here. You can't exactly see what you're doing, so it may take some time to get the screws out. Now, you will gently work the headlight out through the fender well. Move the tire any way you need to and make sure to disconnect the cables from the back of the headlight. Also, be gentle of the plastic headlight ring and make sure to leave that in place. And just reverse the process to install the new headlight in.